Okay, let's have a quick guided tour of this cabinet, uh, starting with the design details. First of all, the doors are to match the customer's internal doors in oak, um, so we've uh, imitated the style of that. The actual cabinet top, um, on the ends, it's actually joined on the mitre. Very difficult joint to make this one because it has to be so precise. I think you can see that quite well on there. Um, this cabinet has a what we call a shadow plinth, so the plinth is actually set back 50mm all the way along on the left and right as well. Um, we'll have a look at some of the features on this now. Um, touch to open doors, so simply touch, door opens and then slides back into the cabinet. Uh, what we do when we, uh, when we deliver this out to you is the um, the doors can be removed to lighten the load, the shelves can be taken out but um, ideally we want to make it as light as possible when we deliver it to you. So The centre section, a pair of doors retractable. This is to get the doors to go back as far as possible. Projection on those is about 50mm so enough to get your finger and thumb on them to open them. You'll notice these um, Side panels have a hole, it's a 35mm hole which gives access to the actual screws for adjustment. So that can be uh, adjusted on site when we get there, uh, if the floor is not level. And then to uh, make that look a bit nicer we put these cover caps in and they press all the way home. A um, bit tricky to get in. Uh, sorry, a bit tricky to get out again, so we don't fit these until we're absolutely certain that it's in the right position. They come in different colours as well for different coloured cabinets, but uh, that's the actual hole cap. Um, adjustable shelves as usual. These fit on shelf pegs, very, very strong. Um, each shelf will hold about 100 kilograms. As strange as it may seem, that's quite a lot. Uh, these touch to open catches, um, very often this little counterpane is glued on, not very strong, um, usually pulls off if somebody pulls the door, so we screw them on. Um, that clicks onto the actual catch, and it's just a touch. Again, touch to open. There is some adjustment on these as well, forward and backwards, so you can align the door perfectly with the edge of the cabinet. Quite a nice little feature, that. All sections have quite a lot, in this case, of cable access at the rear. This is very important, uh, as this client wanted the maximum ventilation possible for his... Um, two amplifiers I think going in this cabinet. So that's basically it. Um, this will go on the website shortly with some um, nice photographs for you to have a look at. Uh, there's also a console table to match this uh, to fit between a pair of the, do uh, the internal doors so that should look quite nice but uh, there you go that's the cabinet. Thank you very much.